guys, I'd like to uh, show you a, another knife I found by a manufacturer I wasn't immediately familiar with. This is Wiss. Uh, they're very, uh, you know, they make a lot of uh, cutting tools, uh, a lot of shears, a lot of scissors. So they are another one of those two manufacturers that are getting into pocket knives. I'm not sure how long they've been in it or not because I wasn't familiar with the vendor. But, you know, I've, I've said before how I love Tanto knives and I love... Uh, uh, you know the easy opening or spring assisted knives and this has got a very strong spring in it and an unusual profile blade this is the blade it's sort of a modified tanto but if you notice from the scoop here and the point on the end it is definitely a sharper than normal point for a tanto type knife uh, it also has these little cutouts uh, I don't know if they're much more than uh, cosmetic but it still makes it look pretty cool now the reason I like this knife is, is that it's a very good knife for example a box opening let me just take a take a simple little box here you know if I get if I'm cutting into a box it's just it's just it's got a, it's got a spear shape basically so you can cut and slash you know it could be used for self-defense or anything along those lines of course too but and it, uh, it's less than twenty dollars. Uh, like most of the two manufacturers who are getting into the knife business, they're not going to be up in the in the in the big knife uh, territory for a price. And if we take a little close look here, uh, we we're, uh, we're going to be looking at something along the lines of uh, of about eight inches, about eight inches in length for the whole. Uh, for the whole knife and we've got a blade of about three three and a half inches so uh, that's well within the limits of most jurisdictions so it's not going to be an issue there it could be a defense knife uh, it, it has the spring assisted opening which is you know which is always uh, assuming a defense type of uh, of knife in my opinion but it is a very good utility knife and with that sharp edge very good for going in and penetrating boxes etc you don't want to pry with it because that's a very very sharp point and I'm pretty sure that you're not going to be able to, to pry anything without bending that point pretty easily and it has a little uh, metal insert here so the format of the blade it's got a belt clip back so it's a good general utility knife and I thought I would show you this there's a manufacturer I wasn't that familiar with you know and in addition to the the, the general manufacturers from uh, you know uh, TAC and uh, the, you know, the mid-range manufacturers uh, I also like to look at new companies that are entering the knife business which seem to be more and more each day or I'm just recognizing more and more each day all right uh, I'll be back with a, a few more blades in the near future and I just want to give you a quick look at this and I will see you next time